I enjoyed last episode even though it wasn't focused on Makoto because we dunked on Tomauki. I refuse to say his name correctly. Tomato, Tomuki, fuck that guy. He deserves that shit. And the worst thing is, he thinks of Tomoe as like some super rare like monster he's gonna capture. Like this dude is so cringe and he doesn't know his place and tomoe literally told the kid oh he, he she first of all there's another dragon kin right something like dragon tamer and she was like oh i got this you know this device come on listen to me dragon and tomoe's like shut the fuck up bitch breaks this kid's toy and then sends them out literally transports them out and it's like do you not know the difference between us Tomauki doesn't understand. I can't wait for the moment where we completely shut on him. On the other side of the spectrum, we got Mio meeting up with Hibiki and kind of basically training them up. Just like how we trained up our other party back in Season 1, you know, with the Alchemy Meister and all of them. Hibiki's party is going to be trained under Mio and getting special gear and all that shit, so I'm sure they're going to get cracked moving forward. And I can't wait until Makoto meets up with them. Let's begin today's reaction, though. What is it? Is it summer? The fuck? It's getting hot in here? New member audition. Oh, we have a house they built for us? Hello? It's been a long time since we've seen them. Does that mean Hibiki sh Komoe? We've only seen Komoe through intermission scenes. Everyone's back? Okay. What a benevolent lord. Imagine Mio made this food? She didn't. Yeah, we have been neglecting our girls, man. Especially Emma. Uh-oh. What did she prepare? Oh, no. What, the seaweed bra? The kelp? Uh-oh. Someone please poison test it. Is it edible? It's edible?! What?! <laughs> That's insane! She actually got good! I mean, we did spend like fucking three episodes into getting her better, but like... Okay, I'm impressed. Yeah, this is true character development, man. Alright. I don't know about that one. I think that she's good at making broth, just like simple shit, right? You literally just put seaweed, dashi, whatever, and just boil the water. She's good at that. But like, I don't trust her for other food. I feel like the running gag will be she sucks at like other more like complicated food, but she's good at like making broth. <laughs> Hibiki? No, who was it? Was it, was it Hibiki? Dude, every time I see these lizard people, I just like want to call them bald. Because they just got like a shiny head with no hair, right? Bald. Bald. <laughs> Right, the place where we made the lake. Tomauki! Tomauki! Fuck that guy. He sucks! We didn't go to the same school, no. What a piece of shit. Arrogant. Rude. Greedy. Absolute scumbag. Trash. He straight up just attack Lime, dude. What did you just say? He may intend to go to war against other humans after defeating the demons. Is that what Lily wants? I honestly, I, I don't know what Lily wants because like Lily is obviously using Tamauki to get her like a political leverage and become like queen of this place, even though she seems to be already ruling over the place, right? But to go against other humans after that. What's your game plan, Lily? He may. Yeah. Lily, what is your what is, picture of a firearm? Guns? Piece of shit's already introduced the concept of fucking guns into this world. Oh my god. I don't even I don't even think he understands like the gravity of the situation. Not that like guns and like like when I say guns in anime, they don't do shit, right? They never, because like, we got fucking magic and stuff. But like, if you're like mass producing firearms for like the casual, like the masses, right? Like, that's actually fucked. This is really dangerous. Yeah, just like average people just carrying guns around. That gets super dangerous. Yes, you should have. You should have. Imagine she killed them there. Imagine if Tomoe killed them. That would have like made it too easy. Because like, because of. Tomauki and their bullshit, right? We're gonna have some fun moments of shitting on them in the future, but inevitably, they're gonna fuck shit up more. But, like, if Tomoe just killed them there, <laughs> it would've been, like, just, like, we would've just skipped an arc, probably. Uh, Gabri uh Sophia Bulga and Lancer. Alright, cool. 
We're being discreet. <laughs> Some rumors? <laughs> no, the war veteran literally said that there's a, there's like, don't they think like Makoto like punished him, right? That war veteran was like traumatized and Tomoe was like, yo, what happened? And the war veteran's like, oh my God, I feel like I'm being punished by some unknown God for fighting against the hu the demons or some shit. I got to stop doing this or they're going to punish me. And Tomoe was like, oh, that's fucking great. And she's just casually laughing while this guy has his fucking foot just like blown off and he's just terrified of PTSD. Tomoe is like, that's our one. Wakasama. Yeah, it's a lake now, yeah. You! So he just... I guess it's more better if he's unaware of his own feats. But like, he's straight up... What happened at the end? He shot the fucking arrow down, created a lake, but did he pass out? He just didn't witness every... He did pass out. That's right. Mio and Tomoe had to heal him. There was a huge... He did go... Yeah. He, he poured it out? Yeah, he poured out and got healed, right? So yeah, I, I guess it makes sense. But the fact that he himself doesn't understand what he did... Like, he doesn't realize that he fucking wiped out the entire war, both the demons and the humans, and created a fucking lake, and he's thinking that it was the goddess? That's insane. That's insane. <laughs> and we're gonna keep that a secret. We're gonna... We're gonna keep that a secret. <laughs> Shiki knows? Does Shiki know? Maybe? Maybe. <laughs> All right, we're going to blame it on a demon. We're going to blame the events to a demon, sure. Popular? Maybe. Oh, oh hello. It's been a while since we've been touchy-touchy with Tomoe. I think Shiki is more popular than Makoto, dude, at school. Yeah, why is it so hot? What the fuck? Why is it so hot in the demiplane? Probably Makoto. Something about Makoto. Yeah, you. What did you do? Because we created mist gates outside, this is causing the temperature to rise? What? Last gate? I forget what the last where the last gate was. The location... Alright. Can't you just close the mist gate or is it too late? Yeah, bro. I mean, you changed like the stars and the landscapes and you do crazy shit, dude. Oh. Hibiki leaving before we got to meet Makoto? Huh. We're not gonna get the encounter. The uh... Because like, I wanted Hibiki and Makoto to meet up. But I guess it's too early, huh? Just... Alright, we'll, we'll set the stage up for a later time. Yeah, all you taught her to do is boil fucking water. Well, she was also trying to kill you in the beginning, but we forget about that. Alright, the elder dwarf uh, gear. Did she just call it a toy? She called it a toy. <gasps> Mio don't care. That's right. And who is Wakasama? No, he's too busy. You know Mio has no intentions to share Wakasama with Hibiki, right? Because as soon as Makoto and Hibiki meet up and like, Oh, you? Wait! What the fuck? Long time no see. You know Mio's gonna get hostile and try to like kill Hibiki. She won't kill, but you've seen how she like competes against little children whenever they start giving, whenever they like start like giving Makoto some fucking favors, right? Mio like will compete with anyone. Fate of the world? I don't care about the world, Giga Chan. She don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> now, leave and stop mentioning my lord. More recipes? How to boil different types of water? Oh, what the fuck? This... <laughs> what was that? <laughs> this, 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 this like scene was really cool for no reason. It's just like the sound effect and suddenly the change in the art style. Sarabada! <laughs> This is how Gazelle leaves, just fucking Sarabada leaves his cape and walks away. Alright, we're fully self-sustainable here. Makoto is literally causing, you know, climate change by himself here. What, what's going on? Are we hiring new people? Let's increase the population. Oh, we're gonna let in new breeds of monsters in. Okay. Well, Demi-human. Who? More waifu candidates? More waifus. Gotta be waifus, right? Oh, 
Yeah, that's when she got a cut. And now she's got a new, now she's got like a new fit, which I really like. That she was so pissed there. Monster consumed the wind spirit. What? You, that, that, that can happen? Wind spirit infused monster remains. Shiki, what are you? Shiki. Shiki sweating. Shiki sweating. I think Shiki did this. Shiki, what did you do? <laughs> okay, you did this. Of course it was you. How did you do this? The fuck? Don't let Mio know. Okay, stuff before we met. Imagine Mio hears about this and realizes she is the reason that her, you know, stuff got cut. She he captured several mid-level spirits, weakened them and fed them the mom. What kind of experimentations have they been doing? What other experiments do you think he's done before too, huh? Yeah, you surely you've done other, right? Uh-oh. Crustaceans, like crabs, fucking lobsters. Big crab. Oh! Was that it? That that crab that that was all callback at the end of the Oh. That's kind of cool how they kind of, you know, make it all the way back. It's like a cool callback. Yeah. No, we don't tell them. No, we don't tell them or Shiki's gonna die. If we tell them, Shiki will literally die. It's gotta be waifus, man. Waifus. Just, I'm just gonna base it on the looks. Actually, if I'm gonna just base them off their looks, I'm just the goddess, aren't I? Literally just picking people because they're hot. Jesus Christ, what have I become? No, they should be privileged. Yeah. That's right. Lay down your balls, Emma. Oh, instead of Emma, what do you want? What do you want? Wait, the, the, wait, 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 wait. These are actual menacing. These are actual menacing geo signs. This is straight up just a joke. It's just a menacing instead of rumble here. Group one, Winkin by Shiki. They have wings, I guess. Oh, I like them. They're pretty cool. Winkin. Just people with wings. They're decent fighters? Yeah? They just want stable jobs and be treated as equally. I mean, fair. What do you mean you don't believe it? It's that terrible outside? <laughs> Damn, I guess it really sucks outside, huh? It's just that hell outside. Everyone's using each other. But Demi plays like a sanctuary. Alright, they passed. Winkin in. Group two, Gorgons. Gorgons. Tomoe. Gorgons are like snake people, aren't they? Gorgons are like snake. Medusa? Medusa? Yeah! Stop, you don't even need to tell me. No, you're in. You're in. I don't care. Just get in. Just come on. Just come on. Are there more of you? Please tell me there's more of you. Please. Blindfolded, big, big, big booby girls. Like, oh, come on now. Get the fuck in here! Skip! Mm -hmm. Oh, because we're suppressing that shit. Oh, how dare you? Do you dare? Damn, Emma. Damn, Emma. <laughs> Petrified. Magic eye type. The food turns to stone? Yo, surely there's a way to, like take out these magic eye abilities, right? And just kind of harvest for our own powers, right? Surely we're gonna save the Gorgons from their own, like, misery and then they can chill here with their eyes. I don't know, I like the blindfold design, though. I do enjoy the blindfold waifu designs. They only have females?! Damn. Their species is only girls and they reproduce by absorbing energy from males of other species. Now, what do you mean, absorb energy? Right? Could you define absorbing energy? Is this the same thing as like Makoto's rings absorbing his mana? Or are you trying to allude to something else? Regardless, I would like to see this process. Okay. <laughs> Makoto knows. Yes, mask on. Yes, mask on. Mana transfer with mask on, Makoto. I think he has a fetish. No, no, no. We, we can't provide you with mates. <laughs> I'm sure everyone's gonna volunteer. Yeah, they're gonna be fucking everybody, dude. Yeah, we gotta do something about those eyes. 
Oh. New type of accessory to help them prevent it? Yo, what about like a veil? You know, like, like a veil. Not, no, no glasses. No. No glasses. Glasses bad. But like a sexy veil, like a transparent veil, man. Like, mm, now we're thinking. Now, now we're thinking, man. Why not? I'm sure we can figure out a way. Probably fixed. Probably. How? Why can you do that? Why? Why can you do that, huh? Why? Makoto just built different. Oh. Boing! <laughs> Mio's gonna be upset about this, man. Mio's gonna boing! I... Dude, does every anime use the same fucking, like, booby, like, sound effect? I swear to God, this is not the first time I've heard these sound effects, right? Like, that sound effect there. Do you think, like, every anime, like, reuses the same, like, sound effect for this? Like, this is the booby sound effect. This is the summer cicada croaking sound effect, you know what I mean? Infidelity, love triangles, how about a foursome? I'll be your father. Oh, one, one night stands? If you're not used to have- I'll be, I'll be your father. Emma is looking pretty fucking pissed off though, and imagine if Mio finds this out, dude. Uh-oh. Mio might just call them. Mio might make them Gorgons extinct. Pass, next one, who are they? This is uh, Mio's- Al Emera. Al Elamera. What, what is that? Fairies! Is, are the lollicons about to win again? Am I gonna unpause this and then are there gonna be lollies in the fucking chair? Because they're fairies. Please. 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 This is not a lolly. It's a fairy. It's a weird thing. I don't even know what the I, I you you I don't think even lollicons enjoy this. You know what I mean? I, it, it, it's just a tiny little thing. I, I don't even know, dude. There's gotta be fairy cons, right? Sh sh uh, like 100% there has to be like fairy con. Is that a, is that a word? Fairy con? I'm sure there has to be. <laughs> Relax, Emma. Fairies and spirits. Commands. Interesting. Emma, chill! They're cute! Excuse me? What? What, what was that? Makoto, that was kind of sus. Why did you say that so quickly? Is there something you want me to... You, you, you want to tell us, Makoto? What do you mean they're small too? What is he... What is he... Meaning? No, I'm, I'm, I'm cooking too much. I, I, he's, he doesn't mean anything, right? Surely he's not a fairy con, right? <laughs> Emma says no! What? Come on! They look like they're fun! <laughs> Sorry, Emma! So what, what, do we, what does Emma want to be called? She doesn't like Emma's son? Is, is that... Too, like, professional? Did she want to be just called Emma? Emma Tan? <laughs> just Emma, right? It's not Emma Tan, that's it. <laughs> just, probably, yeah, just Emma. Oni sama? <laughs> no, it's the wrong anime. Not Miyuki. Damn. Yo, Emma's quite racist. Okay, okay, she relax. Damn! Just a pig! Dude, is that a little fucking insect bug catcher thing? <laughs> a lot of Emma scenes today. Wow! Deferred? Deferred doesn't mean rejected. Deferred just means like, not right now, right? It could be next cycle or some shit, but they're, they're gone from this cycle. Damn! Today's an Emma episode. She's popping off. Contact lenses. Mm, I'm not. Okay, so probably one Gorgon is gonna wear like glasses for the glasses fetish people, and then the other, like me, will just get like contact lenses. But I'm telling you, dude, like, could you imagine like a veil, like like a transparent, like lucent veil? Let's, oh, just 
Think, think of the possibilities, guys. <laughs> no, you can't see their faces through the veil. It's like transparent, kind of. It's like elusive. What is it? What do you, what do you got, Mio? <laughs> this is her next thing that you make. Just fucking celery and carrots and fucking... What is this? Sour cream? Like, what is this shit, dude? <laughs> wow! No, she definitely bought it from a fucking store. <laughs> she made the mayo? Really? Oh, oh, God. Oh, God. Deep. 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 You're probably thinking I'm crazy because you don't watch MASH. But if you watch MASH, you know exactly what I'm saying. Deep. Deep. Is it actually good? Is Shiki going to die if Shiki eats it? Oh, uh, uh, careful. Shiki going to die? Soul going to leave. Wow. She even said it tastes like umami, the most generic thing you say when you taste something and you don't know what to say. Mm, I got the umami taste profiles. Mm, yes, the texture, but... Damn, I thought Shiki's like soul would start leaving his mouth. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Mio's getting good! <laughs> Tomoe working on miso soup? <laughs> Alright, Mio's actually getting good. It's very simple, like, extremely simple, but she's doing it. I don't know what Moto Q is, probably some Japanese reference. I mean, it's definitely a Japanese reference. Oh, winking. Oh! Yo! Yo, why, 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 why are the winking so much flatter than the Gorgons? Oh! Oh! And they're all just purple heads? They're, they're all purple? Oh. Dude, this is great. I'm so glad the Gorgons are here. Wait, what's below? Do the Gorgons have, like, snake tails? What are they standing on? Aku. No, they just have shorts on. Oh, Makoto Rumor. She can teach her? She can teach her. No, never mind. Their illness. Wait, did Shiki and Makoto literally take a sick leave? Like, they said, oh, <laughs> I'm feeling bad today. I can't come into work for like a week. I'm going to go back to the Demi plane. Bye. Is that what's going on? No, they've got good grades. It's different students. Two different students we don't know about. Who are they? Wait, they're hyping up these new, new students. Oh, wait! Ending's playing. New, new students? Transfer student type? I doubt they're bothering since they don't have a pretty face. Blonde guy. Oh, do we, do we know this? Fuck, am I forgetting a detail? Have we met them before? Fuck, I don't remember. Rembrandt sisters! Yo! They're the ones that we fucking judo flipped them, remember? We fucking just like did crazy fucking martial arts against them to cure them. Okay! And that's the episode. Hey, the Rembrandt sisters, I remember them, but not really because like we didn't really get to see their faces, right? Because they were all like bald and their faces are disfigured. So now they're going to look totally different. So interesting. So with the Rembrandt sisters, if they actually remember Makoto and how he saved everybody, I don't know if they're going to keep it a secret, but our reputation might get better. Today was a pretty much a setup episode. One of the most interesting things that happened was was the influence Makoto has opening up, you know, mist gates in other places that could affect, like, the temperature of the demiplane. So, basically, he's causing climate change. Good job, Makoto. Hibiki leaves. And the Mio says, fuck you, I'm not coming with you. Uh, how dare you try to take Wakasama away from me? Nah, he, Mio will never allow the reunion between Hibiki and Makoto. We'll save that for the future. There's some other stuff. Uh, I'm not sure where we're going with this. So, basically, a monster ate, like, a wind spirit, but not really. It was like a research by Hikishiki. So maybe this will craft new, better wind spirit infused items. And interesting to note that we were talking about lesser spirits here. But then the fairies, you know, the uh, the ones that could defer today that, that got rejected also can control spirits. I'm not sure if that's going to tie in somehow. And then the rest is just basically fan service. <sighs> I'm so glad. I'm so glad. I'm sure one of them will wear glasses and the other will have contact lenses to make both sides of the spectrum happy. But that's pretty much it. With this and the lead up of new students coming in, I'm sure next episode will be really fun. But hey, if you're still here, if you'd enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.